Hi, I'm Anthony Hudson. It's time for Saturday Afternoon Football. Today's game from Giant Stadium. They've turned on the weather here in Sydney. Providing special comments for today's game is Gary Lyon. What a game we've got today, Hutto. There really has been a big build-up for this clash. Today we have GWS Giants coming up against Richmond. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. It's a big midfield battle today. Whichever team can get on top in the middle of the ground will walk out winners today. GWS Giants are led by their captain onto the field of play. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The captains converge for the toss of the coin. GWS Giants kicking to the left of screen. Come into this game with really good form. Players head to their positions as we prepare for the opening bounce. The umpire begins proceedings at Giants Stadium. Whitford charges with intent. Brennan hangs onto that one. 45 metres out, an ideal position to be kicking from. Move it on. She can put it through. She's excited about that one. Of course, Hunter. Gets her first. Pretty happy with that one. Brennan with the opening goal. She did really well there and gets the reward. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Back in the middle. Slapped away. With the ball now. The loose ball scooped up. Ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. The umpire calls for it. Guides it down. Goes off the ground. Slams it on the boot. Picked off the deck. Brennan going for number two. Never on target. And a behind. Richmond by seven points. Schmidt considering the options on the kick here. With a driving kick, Randall wins the marking contest. Looks up with a kick. Gets it away under pressure. Intercepts the ball well. Schmidt pushes a low ball. A chance to reload the attack now. Goal-scoring opportunity for Whitford. 45 metres out. Okay. Going for goal number one. A drop part through the goals. Look at her. She really enjoyed that one. That's two in a row for Richmond. The margin is 13. Brennan just slaps it down. Showed good control. Now it's a ball up. Brennan won the tap. Dug it out. Now we've got a ball up. Taps it down. Takes possession. Great tackling there, Hutto. She's picked up an injury, that's for sure. Gaz, what did you see there? She's going to check in with the doctor, but it's hard to see her coming back on. We'll get a stoppage. Slapped away. 
Manufactures the handball. Fought hard to get a handball away. She seems to be struggling at this stage. It might be time for a break. Uses it across half-back. A good mark under the circumstances. Richmond, they're allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Goes by foot. Does well to cut off the kick. Looks up with the kick. Bernardi missed an opportunity to mark. Bennett brushed off easily. High tackle. Lining up for goal. 65 metres out. Friedrich will be upset with that. Scoops it up. Picks up the loose ball. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? There's some great skills on display right now. A great match. She drives it towards goal. Smiles all round. Richmond doing well at the moment. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Has a player running for her. Has a runner alongside her. Beeson gets a quick kick away. Couldn't take it. With a driving kick. They chase after the loose ball. Decides to kick. Dug out the loose ball. Cleanly picked up. Beeson kicks out of the congestion. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. Bar coming onto the ground. Ross goes with the kick. The mark has been taken. Moves it by foot. Butler gets in a good position. Wood keeps coming. Slips the handball to Campbell. Slams it onto the boot. Marks in a bit of space. Uses it now. Taking a nice grab. We're coming to the end of the first quarter. Got boot to ball. Whitford soccers it forward. Going for goal number one. A chance to soccer it and kicks the goal. And that puts them further in front. She's excited about that one. That's four in a row for Richmond. The siren sounds and that's the end of the opening term. The score, the Tigers 25 to GWS Giants, nothing. Richmond should be happy with their lead, Hutto. They came out focused and committed to a very good game plan. Both sides might want to work on their defence after a high-scoring opening term. Any thoughts from you, Gaz? Richmond are controlling the possession and they're using that control to hit the scoreboard. Thanks, Gary. Ready to go for the second turn. Back in the middle to resume play. Swats it with the ball is Parker. We'll get a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Hammers it. Friedrich has the ball. The ball knocked out in the tackle. Brennan goes off the ground. Allen dug it out, gathers it now. Takes a few deep breaths before this important kick. 50 metres out. It on. Going for goal number one. Oh, what about that? That was really special. This kick puts them further into the lead. She's enjoying that goal. The game is back underway. Allen thumps it forward. Scoops up the ball. Goes by foot. Moves the ball along the wing. A big contested grab. Puts it on the boot. 
A great mark taken there. 40 metres out. They are desperate for a goal now. Just offline for a minor score. The Giants fighting hard, but still with work to do. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Goes with the kick. Takes a simple grab. Looks to move it by foot. It's a foot race to get this one. Staunton knows they desperately need this one. Can she deliver? Margin in a really tricky situation. Decides to play on. Sinks the slipper into it. Campbell was surrounded. She needed to mark that, and she did. Sockers it forward. Picked up by Del Pass. Moves the ball by foot. Getting pushed out of the way was Whitford. Beeson throws the ball away. Elects to kick. She takes the mark. Chose to kick it. Allen wins it back. Hurried kick. Umpire pays the free for a deliberate. Zrikak now heading off to the bench for a break. Monaghan with a drilling ball. Slams it on the boot. The ball ends up with Butler. Richmond have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Randall just gets it out of the boot. Ball up calls. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. Uses the hands instead of the body, and it's a free kick. She heads for home. Darts it through for another. She celebrates hard after that. About to resume hostilities. Thumps it clear. Great control there. Chips it towards half board. Far couldn't hang on to the ball. Just landed in her back. Move it on. She decides to go for home. Drop punt straight through the middle. That's her first. Her teammates rush over. Richmond by 29. This is how they can score, Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. GWS Giants are creating plenty of chances from turnover. They just need to generate that into more scoring opportunities to be a big chance. Great tackle. She's got the football now. Strong mark in the contest. Well within range from here. Move it on. Looking to kick goal number two. Richmond by five goals, weighing up the options now. Bennett's got under it. Well, it's half-time, Gaz. What are your thoughts at the major break? Richmond will go into the rooms at half-time with plenty of confidence and back themselves for the second half. Let's analyse the stats. Richmond lead the contested possession at the moment and they're converting that lead into scoreboard pressure. Thanks for that, Gary. Well, I hope you enjoyed that first half. Back soon with a second half action. A big second half about to begin. Thump clear. She gets her hands on the footy. Moved on by Eva. Just gave it away with quick hands. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Finds this one all by herself. Moves it on. Keeps it alive, under some pressure. 
Just manufactures what she could. Conti decides to go it alone. Rash decides to soccer it. Finding the loose ball was Whitford. Great mark in the pack. Going for goal number two. That one rams into the post. 31 points the difference. Deciding where to go with the kick in. Schmidt plays onto herself. Elects to kick it long. Bar takes the mark. Richmond just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. The kick from Schmidt. Good body work to win the mark. Brennan moves it now. Soccer's a kick. Ball picked up. Got the hands free. The handball hits the target. A stab kick from Campbell. Stevenson couldn't keep her hands on it. Uses it by foot. Collected by Friedrich. A bit too hard with the push, and it's a free kick. A solid mark from Schmidt. Puts boot to ball. Marked by Del Poss. Decides to kick. Found space for an easy mark. Tully puts it on the boot. Dropped the mark she should have taken. Friedrich just gets it onto the boot. She's the number one ranked player on the ground. The opposition need to get a hold of her. Brash turns a free kick. The mark is taken by Friedrich. Chose to kick it. Whoa, what a mark! Slams it on the boot. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Yeah, she's barely touched the ball, Hunter. Goes inside forward 50. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. Okay. She likes her chances from here. Almost missed the boot with the kick. She puts it out of bounds on the full. Moves it by foot. The mark is taken by Grash. Goes with the kick. Finds a bit of room to mark. Uses it now. It's going to be deemed as deliberate. With a driving kick. Takes the mark. Quick handball. Del Pass links up with a chance to run. Ends up with Conti. Conti with a chance if she can keep her cool. Big kick required from this distance. 50 metres from home. Wood going for number one. She's missed the lot. Kick goes astray and it's out on the full. Looks up with a kick. Takes that one strongly. Moves the ball by foot. Ends up turning this ball over. 35 metres out. She can put it through. Nurses that ball through the big sticks. She's enjoying every second of it out there. Gets her first. Gets some reward for her efforts. Back with another centre bounce. With GWS Giants with a lot to think about. They trail by 37. Richmond will be looking to not only hold their lead, but they want to put this beyond doubt early and run away with a big win. Let's check out the stats. Richmond getting plenty of possessions at the moment. Thank you, Gaz. Let's see what this last quarter throws up. They need to get a move on if they're gonna win from here. Won the hit out. Eva gets the ball. Quickly onto the boot. Easily takes the mark. Looks to move it by foot. Finds this and marks well. Stabs at the kick, and the mark will be paid. Bernardi with a pretty easy kick. Hold on to the ball for a few moments and just take the sting out of the game. Going for goal number one. The drop part sails between the big sticks. 
They get around her after that effort. Richmond lead by 43. One down. She gains the possession. Del Pass slips the tackler. Goes by foot. Good mark there. Puts it on the boot. Conti uses the body well. Keeps going. Puts boot to ball. Great mark. Elects to kick. Marks now and can send it back. Uses it by foot. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. Sinks the slipper into it. Finding the ball was Barr. Pushes off the tackler. Used the hands and gives away the free. Allen puts it on the boot. Parker over the top. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Richmond forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. I hate to say it, Hutto, but this game is over. Campbell slick with the hands. They can create from this. Just put her hands in the back of the opponent and it's a free. Parker looks in need of a spell. Easily takes the mark. Richmond haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Randall spills it. Campbell with the mark. Got boot to ball. Terrific mark there. Looks to move it by foot. Staunton with an easy mark. Decides to kick. Great mark under pressure. Good opportunity for GWS Giants to put a goal through here. Stands tall and marks. Moves the ball by foot. Doing well to intercept that kick. Tips it towards half forward. Takes that one strongly. 45 metres out. Move it on. They really need a goal on the board now. She pops through the goal. It's home. Can that goal be the spark? She loved that one. GWS Giants close the gap to 37. We resume hostilities. Tap down. Bennett comes away with the ball. They can link up now. Great grab. Rush. Sends one up towards the wing. Parker found some space and marked. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Richmond forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Macro whacks one on the boot for goal. Whiteley wins the ball in the air. Ten metres out. Move it on. A good result there, and that's a goal for GWS Giants. Congratulated by her teammates. GWS Giants reduced the margin. Centre bounce. Won it down. Clean from the half volley. Dug out by Friedrich. Ball up in the centre square. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game's going. Not the most exciting match, but the fans of the winning side will feel pretty good right about now. Gary, what did you think of today's game? They would have been expecting a better result than this today. It's definitely not what they are. Thanks, Gary. Here's the final scores. Richmond, 8-3, 51. Versus GWS Giants, 3-2, 20. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. It's been a pleasure, Hutto, and we'll catch you next time.